Welcome back to Selly Entertainment. I'm your host, Ryan Vincent, and tonight we got the Bullet Vipers versus the Valley Growlers. Live from MSA Arena in beautiful Abbotsford, British Columbia, this is the 3-on-3 three three Classic Season 9. With me, not so classic, but still a co-host, Aaron Green. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another 3-on-3 three three Classic. If you've clicked on this video, do us a small favor. Hit that subscribe button, smash that thumbs up, leave a comment while you're there. Green. That was the Bullet Vipers we just seen wearing those creamy color jerseys, and they have Adams in between the pipes for them. And on the other end, right in front of our eyes, it's the Valley Growlers wearing those black jerseys with brown and red trim, and they have Bueller in between the pipes for them. Hello, Adams, and hello, Bueller. This is the 3 on 3 Classic, Season 9, Division 3, and I'm excited. I'm excited with you. Green, on that note, I want to take a quick second to apologize in advance. If I mispronounce your name or call you the wrong number, I'm sorry. Furthermore, if your number is not on the oh, roster, oh, oh, oh. I will just be calling you by your name as the Valley Growlers waste no time. Don't let me finish my introduction and get the first goal of the game. They ain't sitting around waiting for us, my friend. Oh, why, look at that. Why would they, Green? A beautiful apple by Shaw. Number five, Brunsma, gets the first goal of the game, and the Valley Growlers are the ones who are on the board. You're first on the board. Back in the action is the Growlers hanging oh. again. Looks like he had a breakaway, but this time Adams was there to make the save. Dude, this kid's got hands. Holy cow, Green. I have seen... I recognize this team. I've seen them for the last uh, three nice years, and it's cool to see the development yeah. out there because I don't recall Hagen doing those kind of moves when I first seen him three years ago at the 3-on-3 three three Classic oh. as Lockhart gets tripped up and face plants oh. into the ice, but his backup partner Lockhart collects it. Nice pad save by Adams, and there is that tripping card. I got to see this in slow motion. I think it was a knee-on-knee. I don't think it was a knee on knee. Let's We're going to have a look here. Yep, oh, you're yeah. right. It was a knee on knee. <laughs> <laughs> I am completely wrong. Oh, yeah. That was a big knee on knee. And number 13, Lockhart. Thank God that he's all right. Yeah. He's going to get the penalty shot here. All low with Adams oh! on the backhand. And Lockhart, number 13, seals it up to get the second goal of the game for the Valley Growlers. He was out so far, I didn't think he was going to get that. I didn't think he was going to get back in, Green. He was out so <laughs> Dude, far. That was crazy. It was like he was washed away in a rapid. There was no coming back to shore. Uh oh. Uh, play Two continues on, on. The Valley Growlers pick it up. It's Hagen. Hagen with speed getting pressured by a. Oh. oh, doesn't matter who he's getting pressured by because Hagen just got his first goal of the game. Dude, look at this, man. He moves his body so quickly. Very skilled hockey player this kid has turned it into, Green. Oh, yeah. He just addressed the goalie. It's so cool. I know this is a Matrix and this is live. If this wasn't live and this was edited, it would be cool to go back three years ago and post clips of him in this game and you could see the development, literally. They can just go back on our YouTube channel. They can go back on YouTube. Back in the action. Nicholson for the Valley Growlers with that puck on the near side getting pressured by Polakhan. Polly, way to tie him up. That's really good hockey right there. Tying him up nicely. Polly can. There you go. Uh, Saeed picks it up for the Valley Growlers. Saeed throws that puck towards, and it doesn't make oh, it there. The post. Hits the post. Nicholson in there. In tight in the dirty zone and scores. Nicholson gets his first goal of the game, and that's four unanswered goals by four different players from the Valley Growlers. Right in the paint, both of them. Look at this. Gets his stick down. That was nice. Really nice goal. That's hard work and determination yeah. right there, ladies and gentlemen. That's what got that goal for the Valley Growlers. Four to nothing. The Growlers over the Vipers with 13 minutes and change left to go in the first. They got a little bit of a jump on them here, eh? Right away they do, Green. Uh, it's Shaw flying high speed. Shaw. Oh! Whoa! What a goal by the Valley Growlers. Unbelievable yes, play. It all starts off with Shaw. High speed. He's hardwired right into the modem. There's no Wi-Fi going on, so oh. you don't have a busy signal. And it looks like that is number 97 Mitchell, who gets his first goal of the game. So that's five goals by five different players of the Valley Growlers. I like it. I love it. Whew, man, Some, did he have that goalie trick there, eh? That was a really Ooh, nice goal, Green. They're, they were flying. He was sliding so bad he had no chance to save that puck. Bull of Vipers trying to get that puck out of the zone. They finally do. Sundar! Oh, another knee on knee. Eats a body rated uh, neutral ice there, and the referee's there. I'm guessing it's going to be body contact. There it is. Yeah. That would be my guess. Let's see if it was another knee on knee. I think it's no, it's body. Oh, yeah. oh wow. Dude. 
It was two, man. I don't know if that was a knee, well, on, a knee, knee. on knee. It's close. He did throw the shoulder as well. Regardless, Sundar is going to get the penalty shot. Sundar for the Bullet Vipers trying to put him oh, up. Oh, he almost had it. The poke check by Bueller. Bueller yeah. leaves his team scoreless. Yeah, that was a nice save. He leaves the other team scoreless is what I meant to say. The kid had the move too. He almost beat him. Almost beat him. Almost doesn't cut it. No, that's exactly what I was going to say. Almost <laughs> doesn't count. As Hagen turns it right back around. Tries to go between the legs. Gets a little flashy and uh, no go for I Adams. I don't hate it. I don't hate it. If you're up five, get a little flashy on him, right? If you're up five, that's all right in my book screen. Yep. It's when you're not up and you try to pull that stuff. That's a little <laughs> weird. Uh, yeah, clean. you don't want to be doing it on goal one. No, you don't. <laughs> I mean, unless you got a clear cut breakaway. Oh, he just skated right into oh, him. Oh, man, that did Dude, not look put good. Your head He's on up, the kid. ground. Yikes. What? No. Body contact. Green's up in arms about this. Let's he run this he back. He skated into me and his head down. Let me see. Yeah, he did there skate into There was no hit him. on that. The guy, the guy was just forechecking. He was coming out of the zone. He had his head down. Yeah, that's a tough one. That's a, that's a bad call. Well, Mitchell is going to get the penalty shot. Oh. And Mitchell, there you go. Carbo works out. It always does. It went green. off the post. He did not get it. Um, it was meant to be that way. Yeah. Did you think that was a hit though? I don't know. No, Back okay. in the action, I'm not going to say. I'll leave that. I went up to you, Green. Yeah, I, I didn't think it was. He had his head down. Cleve was battling with the puck. As Mitchell skates away with it for the Valley Growlers in the zone. Uh, trying to get oh, around nice. the wall. Nicholson bats it right out front. And Adams makes a huge save. Puck is loose. And the referee blew the whistle saying, I lost sight of it. Good goaltending right there. Yep. Uh, Geoffrey has that puck for the Bullet Vipers. Geoffrey right over to Mosher. Gives it up to the Valley Growlers. The Valley Growlers are hungry, Green. Their stomach is growling. Dude, they are all over the Vipers. Shaw back in the zone of the Bullet Vipers on the back. A nice save by Adams. Valley Growlers still have it. Nope, they don't. We're going to run back this. Really nice save. Yeah, Bueller's. Holy cow, did you see oh, that? Oh, sorry. Adams is literally keeping them in the game. I think that was the, the blade of the skate of Adams, which made that save. He's doing phenomenal, man. He's the only reason this game is 5-0. Yeah, it would be a lot worse. It'd be a lot worse. He's he's killing it. Delisle, number 19, skating with that puck. Gets checked off by Lockhart. Lockhart carrying it in his zone, fighting with it a bit. Now he's settling it down as it's in front of him. Backhands it. Nice pass. Open to neutralize as Nicholson gains his zone. Nicholson lets it rip, and there's a glove of Adams, which shuts him down. Dude, you can hear that hit the glove. Hard shot by Nicholson. Bullet Vipers in their own zone. Nice work by Bruinsma. Doesn't work out. Puck stopped on the line by Lockhart as Bruinsma holds the zone. Lockhart collects it on the far side. Half boards. Back and forth right here. Lockhart gets it to Shaw. on the blue line. Shaw walking it in a little bit on the near side. Getting hacked by number 15. Shaw fires it all the way over. No one was there. Picked up as Hagen. Hagen stops and turns it around the other way. Hagen dancing there. Right by the oh, house. Oh, Makes a little move. Hagen oh, he gets it. What a goal by Hagen. A highlight reel for this kid. <laughs> His second goal of the game. Green, let's appreciate uh, this in oh, slow I motion. Will. I will. This is absolutely fantastic. Look at this. Just puts it between his legs. Still picks up the puck. Draws the goalie up. Puts it right over his shoulder. That was gross. Textbook, baby. That was disgusting. That was so good. Hagen is the MVP here, Green. Oh. Six to nothing. The Valley Growlers over the Bullet Vipers. And I can honestly say from just watching it again over the past three years, I think Hagen is one of the most improved players of this He's Valley good. Growlers team. He's good. Keep an eye on this kid, ladies and gentlemen, as well as everyone else. This is just who I notice, and okay. my opinion means nothing. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Uh, back in the action, Sundar skating away from a Valley Growler. Hagen, Hagen yeah. is pressuring him, strips him of the puck, and feeds it over to Lockhart. These Lockharts are uh, studs on the ice, and Whoa. there you go, Green. Lockhart, number 13, gets his second goal of the game. Another notable pairing is the two Lockharts from the Valley Growlers. Yeah. Been watching them as well for the last few years, and they never disappoint, Green. You know what happened there? Adam thought he was going to go for a big deke, so he didn't try to go too soon, and then he just shelved it right over him. It's that Lockhart skill. <clears throat> Seven to nothing. The Valley Growlers over the Bullet Vipers. That was a smart, smart play. Hagen again stripped the puck away from the Bullet Vipers. Hagen now all alone. He was with Mitchell. Mitchell couldn't connect. Wide. They needed a little bit of that Shaw internet to help them. <laughs> Uh, Mitchell has that puck again. Mitchell winding around everyone, and this time he does it to get a second goal of the game. Dude, he made that look good, too. That was really look good. He intercepted the pass right here, went around one Viper, two Vipers, three Vipers, backhand, shuffle it in.
Like, uh, a, like a deck of cards. <clears throat> and just shuffled it in. He's, uh... Growlers are really good. Eight to nothing. The Growlers over the Bullet Vipers. Sundar trying to make something happen for the Bullet Vipers right now. Sundar one-on-one. -on -one. Has a shot off of the crossbar. Almost. That could be the Bullet Vipers' best chance of the game so far. We might have a little mismatch in divisions here, Green. I think so, too. I mean, I don't. maybe they're just having a real... No, nah, it's mismatch. It's got to be mismatch. Uh, here you go, Nicholson. Fanned on it. Nice pressure by the Bullet Vipers. Uh, actually, I think the Bullet Vipers took it away from him, number 15, Vayason. But it's Johannesson. Driving to the net, trying to slam that puck five-hole. Doesn't work as Adams got him beat. Nah. Not today. Mosher after that puck for the Bullet Vipers, but so is Sean. Oh, he's going to get there up. first. It's Mosher trying to throw it out front to number 16, but the Valley Growlers took away that pass with his stick. Come on, get that puck. Big battle, Valley. Bullet Vipers pick it up. I'm so used to saying Valley Growlers in this game. Yeah. <laughs> it's just automatic for me now. It's weird seeing uh, the Bullet Vipers, Vipers touch the puck. Joffrey. Tried to dish it out front, but it's intercepted by Lockhart of the Valley Growlers. Lockhart now off to the races. He's wheeling green. He's dealing. He's at the casino. He's going to hit Blackjack. How was that not offside? He busted. It was 22. He hit on a 10 ace. I don't know how he passed it he so far. He hit on 21. He hit on 21. He hit on an ace. He hit on 21. A 10 ace. And that's the end of the first period. The eight to nothing, the Valley Growlers over the Bullet Vipers. <laughs> Little lopsided, great goaltending. Listen, if you made it as far as you haven't yet, do us a small favor. Hit the subscribe button, smash that thumbs up. Let's get right back into it. Here we are, the second and final period for the three on three classic season nine against Bullet Vipers and the Valley Growlers. Bullet Vipers carry that puck, trying to get a first goal. They can't, they get shut down by Bular. We haven't heard that name much here. Lockhart skating with that puck, 43. Lockhart gains the zone of the Bullet Vipers. Swerving through traffic as he collects that puck. Throws it right out front. Nobody was there. The other Lockhart was pinching a little bit, Green. Lockhart has that puck on the far side. Nice move. Turns around from danger. Lockhart feeds Hagen. Hagen, uh -huh. nice little move to switch yep. stances as he curls right back around. Yep. Hagen was looking for Lockhart. Nice stick by Lockhart, but the Bullet Vipers finally get it up. Here we go. Nice stretch pass right to Sundar, who's all alone. Sundar, one on oh. oh. Get yeah, shut down and score. Gets it. Sundar gets the first goal for the Bullet Vipers, and they're on the board. All I wanted them to do was get on the board. That's it. They're on, Green. That's a win for me. They are on the board. That first shot was saved by Bular. Sundar stuck with it. Powered to the net, follow the puck a little bit after shock yep. right there. Great goal by Sundar. Eight to one, the Valley Growlers over the Bullet Vipers. I'm just happy they they made one, man. They did, Green. It was they really did offside. Indeed. Valley Growlers throw towards the net, nice save by Adams as the Bullet Vipers pick it up in their own zone. Hustling that puck out, it's Vayason. Vayason gains the zone of the Valley Growlers, dishes it off to there it uh, is. Polly Kahn. Oh. There, Vayason has a shot, nice save by Buller. Should have went upstairs. Yeah, he should have, Green. He should have, right? Go, go run downstairs and tell him yeah. that he should have gone. He'll, he'll know when he hears this. <laughs> should have went upstairs, kid. There you go. Uh, Mitchell, nice, nice stick by Gregor, but the Valley Growlers are right by him. They collected it. Shaw lays a little bit of a forearm. Shaw making moves. Bullet Viper swiped that puck away from him. Shaw's in a battle with Jeffrey, Jeffrey right now. Oh, Jeff. I thought he was going to go for the hit. Jeff Fry. <laughs> That's a tough one. Jeff Roy? It's, all, it's an easy one. Geo Fry. Geo Fry! As, uh, I'm going to stop with that. Big scramble Thank right you. here. You're welcome. <laughs> Johannesson's trying to find that puck, but so is number five, Brunsma. And the what referee's seen enough. He said, nah. Did you lose sight Whoa, of there, There's a penalty on the play, Green. For what? Well, maybe it was out of sight. Let's see. Oh! oh. There it is. A, a sneaky... A slewy by Cleve. Yeah. He stuck his foot backwards. Dude, we don't usually miss things like that. Weird. Well, we did that time. And uh, oh, I say number five Bruins, but can't put it behind Adams. Dude, Adams, I got, I can't say enough. He's good. Chirp us in the comments. We're missing a penalty. We give it to you guys. Give it to us. Don't be shy. Uh, here we go. Lockhart of the Valley Growlers in a little bit of a battle with 15 Vaison who comes up victorious. Vaison working that puck turns around from danger, <laughs> trying to set something up. He's at a Sundar, the only. Person oh, with a goal on so the team close. of the Bullet Vipers so far as LaHaye is fighting for it and lost it. Valley Growlers on the rush now. Nice move by Hagen. Hagen gains the zone of the Bullet Vipers. Hagen all alone. Hagen on the backhand. It makes it look easy to get his hat trick goal of the game. 
I was hoping he was going to do something snazzy there. You know, I, that was snazzy right there in the neutral zone. Yeah, Green. I wanted a between the legs or something. Sorry, crazy we couldn't here. give you everything that you hoped and dreamed for, no, but okay. I thought that was great. That no, was good. Great I job mean, by Hagen. Great hat trick by Hagen, and uh, great work by Hagen. When you're up nine, do something. Do something harsh. Nine to one, the Valley Growlers over the Bullet Vipers. Blow the roof off this place. Well, I mean, did you not see that play? That was a really good goal. Mitchell fires it over to Lockhart. Lockhart gains his zone of the Bullet Vipers. One on one with the D man. Goes around the D man and goes around the goalie. Oh, man. Nice goal by Lockhart. Let's hear Green criticize that one. That was beautiful. That was almost the that same as That was just those. absolutely insanely perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Look at, oh, just address the goalie. <laughs> That was pretty much the same as the last goal we won. I know. It was the exact same. Same thing. It was beautiful. It was good. It was great. It was all right. <laughs> no one. Dude, the Valley you're up 10, man. Get flash me now. <laughs> Johannesson collects that puck for the Valley Growlers. Was looking for a Bruins ball, but it was just out of his range. You know what? Next year, remember everything I said. When you're up nine goals, start getting flashy. Do a 360 right before you shoot or something. Ac actually, just put your headphones on whenever he's talking and listen Don't. to me because I'm the one that matters here. <laughs> uh, puck out back. <laughs> what? Oh, I chirped you. Who cares? You're not allowed. Get, get over it, Green. Get over being it. Nice, we're being nice to we're each other. We're being nice to each other. That's okay. There's a penalty on the play. One slip out. No big deal. <laughs> um, Johannesson behind the net. Ooh, he got that bad. He put up his forearm. Looked like Johannesson was going to run into him. I don't yep. know if that was, might have just been a little bit of self-defense. The penalty might have been a little overboard, in my opinion. But Johannesson gets shut down by the glove of Adams. Now, Anyways. that was a nice save. That was a really nice Dude. save. Uh, Lockhart has a shot. Yo er, Adams makes a save. Thumbs on fire. Pull of Vipers. Back at it. Polyquan. Here we go. Nope. Lost it. Lost it as the Valley Growlers lose it. Big scramble right here. Lockhart turns it right back around. They play back and forth, but now it seems the Valley Growlers have settled down and have possession as Mitchell feeds it right over to Nicholson. Adams again makes a save, and I'm wondering if they had a shot clock running, how many shots would oh. we see against Adams here tonight? Oh, it'd be just trillions. There has been hundreds. There we go. Green. Nice moves by Sundar, and he still tries to push that puck towards the net. You got to give it up to Sundar. The one and only goal scorer so far, the Bullet Vipers. Heart, man. He does, and it's showing here, Green. Yeah, he doesn't even care. He's not giving up. No, I would like to see what he looks like in an evenly matched game as Adams shuts the door again. Man, this Adams kid is a stud in between the pipes. Yeah, I'd love to see him on a, like, a really good team. On an like, evenly matched game, yeah. he would stick out like a sore thumb, Dude, he'd Green. Be phenomenal. I'm sure a lot of these kids would. It's just, what do you do? We've seen... Uh, oh, nice save by Adams again. We've seen a couple of three on three. Oh, mismatched? Yeah. Well, yeah. A happens. lot of them have been great. You got to give it up to the, yep. the matchmakers. They've done a much Most better job good. this year, but we have seen some 29 to nothings. Only a few. Only a few. It's getting, Only a couple. It's getting better and better as every year goes on, Green. Oh, he had a chance right there. He did indeed. Back to the action. Nicholson gets stripped, but the Valley Growlers hold it down in their own zone. It's uh, Saeed feeds it up to Bruinsma. Bruinsma in the zone of the Bullet Vipers. Tried to do a little drag move and gets stood up by Mosher. Great D work to play the body. Give it up to the Bullet Vipers D-man. Hagen oh, tries see, to go between the legs and follow it up, but Adams was not biting there, Green. Nope. Lockhart carried it in on the far side. Feeds it over to Hagen. Hagen tried to do a little toe drag move to feed it to himself out front, but the D work of Mosher again broke that up. I ran down there and told them to be more flashy, and they're listening. <laughs> Hagen fed it right up front oh, to Lockhart, nice. and number 13, Lockhart gets his hat trick goal of the game. We're not supposed to be running back uh, goals right now. They're top 10. Uh, I don't think it is. I think now it is, Green. <clears throat> okay. Nice goal. Let's not take anything away from that of Lockhart. <laughs> and now there is a 10-goal difference. There wasn't before. Yep. Now there is. So I don't believe we'll be running any goals back um, <clears throat> unless the editor makes errors and he forgets about it. Then we might. <laughs> we'll find out. Green Valley. Growlers <laughs> rip a shot and score. Which means <laughs> Nicholson, as the editor, forgot about our golden rule here and let's appreciate the play <laughs> Adams awesome. makes a huge save Nicholson picks it up look at his edge work oh dude that was a really nice goal watch Nicholson skates there <laughs> see what he did green I did did you <laughs> fire the editor 12 to 1 <laughs> you're supposed to be nice 
12 to 1. The Valley Growlers over the Bullet Vipers. He's not here. Mitchell streaks in. Mitchell has a shot. Nice pad saved by Adams. <laughs> Nicholson goes to collect it for the Valley Growlers as he throws it right out front. Oh, that was nice. And 97, Mitchell gets his hat trick as we run this back. <laughs> Mitchell has a shot. I'm just going to let it run back. Adams makes a save. Nicholson picks it up, throws it out front right to Mitchell. Nice patience from Mitchell. He made the goalie bite there like he was eating beef jerky. He kept biting. Nom, 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 nom. It's chewy, Green. Easy to bite. Back to the game. 13 to 1. The Valley Growlers over the Bullet Vipers with 13 or 30 seconds left to go in the hockey oh, game. I he might get, oh, here he goes. Lockhart lost it to Sundar. Sundar! Oh, Dude. there's a penalty on the play. Dude, they, these guys just keep slew footing each other. Was that a slewy? Yeah, he kicked, he got his feet behind him. He did it on purpose. Well, let's have a look. Let's Green. run it back. Watch. Here we go. Sundar Watch. against he Johannesson. Uh yeah, he kind of he got him. He went for the motion, oh, yeah. you could see there. Might have led with the legs a little bit. And Sundar, the one and only goal scorer for the Come Bullet on, kid, Vipers, lock up one more. is going to have a penalty shot against Bular. Oh, yeah. Sundar gets his second goal of the game. And MVP that's two right there. for the Bullet Vipers. That's the MVP right there. 13 oh, no. to 2 with 15 seconds left to go in this game. And Adams. Johannesson got robbed. And the Valley Growlers are not letting up, Green. No. They I mean, don't why, care. Why would they? They came to play hockey. Yep. That's what they're here to do. Dude, you're. It doesn't matter what the score is, man. And that's the end of the game. 13 to 2. The Valley Growlers over the Bullet Vipers. It was still fun. I had a good time. It was a lot of fun, Green. Uh, we got to watch some good hockey. Yep, we Bullet did. Vipers goaltender was phenomenal. Bular, we've seen a little bit of. He was shining. Both teams played great. Maybe a little bit of a mismatch, but what do you do? They still put up a battle. Got a couple goals on the board. Great game. Thank you and good night from Sally Entertainment. Like and subscribe.